Okay, um, I got a request for Apple hotkeys or keyboard shortcuts. So I'm just going to show you some of the really important ones that, or I view as important and very useful. Okay, to close an, or to minimize an individual window, you're going to press Apple M, and it will go down here. So you can just click it and come back. Okay, to close an individual window, you're going to press Apple W. In this program, it just uh, exits out the entire program. But in another program, for instance, let's say Safari, you have another tab open. It will close that tab. So, yeah. Okay, uh, to quit an application, you're going to press Apple Q. That's, um, that in case uh, the application doesn't completely close out from just closing one window, that's how you close the entire program when all the windows or tabs open in it. Okay, now moving on to screenshots. The first screenshot is Shift Apple 3. This screenshot takes um, a picture of your entire screen, as shown here. See, uh, there's the keyboard viewer, just the entire screen. Okay, so I'm going to close that. And another picture would be of an just individual piece of the screen. You're going to press Shift Apple 4. And you're going to drag this little, uh, I guess, pointer across any point of the screen that you want. And the picture will just appear here. Um, okay, so here it is. So I'm going to just close that window. And uh, the, four, the third and final one is going to be Shift Apple 4. This control thing will come up. You press spacebar, and you can take a picture of just your background, an icon, the menu bar, keyboard viewer, or any other application that you want. So I'm going to take a picture of keyboard viewer. And here it is. So those are all the icons that I view as most important. Okay, um, if you like my videos, don't forget to subscribe and or request another one. Okay, thanks for watching.